did the coffee cart close? Essentially, it closed because the um, food service people, um, the director, spent the day on campus and noticed that we were supposed to be closed when the cafeteria is open. It's not, it's not gone. Right now it's closed temporarily, temporarily until we get approval from the director of food services that we're in compliance with CDE regulations. It is closed for improvements. Right now we are closed for maintenance until further notice. Some of the employees at the Bean, they opened about, you know, 10 to 15 minutes too soon, and she basically wrote, wrote them up. Okay, I used to work it like three times a day for the past, like, since the beginning of the school year, and now I have nothing to do during my off periods, and it's boring. Well, I know that the school down the treasurer's office submitted their paperwork today, got approved, so they'll be back open tomorrow. Okay. Ivy Store submitted their stuff late today, so they'll probably get approval sometime tomorrow or the next day, so they should be open by Monday. Hmm. I haven't heard back from the copy card yet. Things need to be taken care of sometimes, things aren't up to par. As soon as they get it in, food services are pretty good about turning it around. BVSD's health regulations, <laughs> we have to improve the way we take care of our food. I just know that it has been profitable for the business club and uh, the Fairview Business Department as a whole. To get our, you know, to get the business back, we have to contact Ann Cooper, the super food service director, and talk with her about, you know, essentially basically beg for our business back, um, that we're not selling things that are, you know, too overtly harmful to people, that we're selling decaf, and that um, all of our drinks are, you know, reasonable and nutritional value.